March is arguably my busiest time of the year, so I didn't think I would have time to write and edit and film a video. So instead, I've decided to vlog the month. So prepare your brains, because this is March. So my roommates have their own theater company and I'm gonna go see their play tonight called Le Froid est un détail de l'hiver. It's kind of funny living with actors because you see little tidbits of them rehearsing. I'm excited to see it all actually put together. My work is improv and also a lot of my volunteer work is there and a lot of my social activities. So there's gonna be a lot of improv in this video and it starts tonight. Improv match! Tonight we're recording a few episodes of the Ohatmu or Not podcast from the Fire and Water Podcast Network. You should watch it. You should listen to it. Because that's what you do with podcasts. We are used to the video format. <laughs> <laughs> Would you... <laughs> so, 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 ring race. We're having a girls' night tonight. Spring. We're being girly. I look like a serial killer. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't human skin. It's oh, is it? <laughs> It's truly horrifying. I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. No one's gonna sleep ever again. <laughs> I've been invited as a guest on a podcast called Le Buzz, hosted by Marcel Richard and Martin Saunier. I rarely get invited just as me, so that's going to be interesting. I think it's going to be fun. Oh, look at the little puppy. You're trying to eat my lunch, but you can't have my lunch. I'm riffing an improv match tonight. Gotta get ready. We're going to the movies tonight, which is about like 90% of what we do. I think most of their activities is just watching a film. In fact, I'm just going to insert a montage here of all the times we watched a film in March. We're watching a film! 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 I coach the University of Moncton improv team and tonight is our last practice before we go to the national tournament next week. I'm pretty excited. They're a pretty awesome team. I'm pretty lucky. All the emotions. Ugh. Doing a terrifying face mask. A friend of mine is launching his the second volume of his book today, so we're at his book launch. Candy. So Juste, you wrote two books. It's true. Yes, I'm very uh, happy and uh, proud uh, of that uh, accomplishment. Uh, is that a word? Yes. It's always been a dream for me to, to write a book. And uh, the dream is now reality. Uh, I'm not funny in English, I can't speak English. But the, the books are in French. But if you are better than me in French that I am in English, you will like the book. And you will be able to read it. Huh? Take two or three words and put that together and make a sentence. And now, more improv. Also, Dallas, I believe. The match with in Today's the 17th of March and I just by pure chance actually wore green and we also went to see 10 Cloverfield Lane. Cloverfield. Very very thematic day. So we're leaving for Montreal tomorrow and basically I should be finishing the whole packing situation. I'm actually not too bad at packing. I still have a tendency to overpack. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna do my best. Let's get packing. It's about seven something in the morning. We're about to leave for the tournament soon. Whispering, cause I don't wanna wake up my roommates. Nothing says driving to Montreal like a good snowstorm. Hello. Hello. Chez nous à la maison, c'est moi le grand garçon. J'aime ça toucher à tout. Appelle le caillou. Also, I'm eating a donut. Oh my god. 
do you believe in life after love, after love, after love? So we made it to Arustuk and um, we just run out of gas. That's a thing that's happening. So we're waiting for the other car to come and save us with more gas. Olivia, anything to say? I wanted Jesus to take the wheel. That's what I really wanted. That's what he did and he didn't gas. I know. <laughs> Olivia's given up. Seb, do you want to say something about the fact that we're stuck here? Step number one, pretend it's the end of the world. Step number two, call for help. Step three, find food. It doesn't have to be good. Oh, it's hot, it's hot. Step number four, find some help. <laughs> Step number five, celebrate. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> wow. They've come to save us! Oh, it's another shell! Oh, it's another shell! It's come out of a more car, some black! Shelly! <laughs> As I'm editing this video, I realized I did a very terrible job at actually filming anything during the tournament. So, um, here's a recap of the tournament. Marco made us one! But, like I said before, I'm really proud of them. I think they were a pretty awesome team, and I'm excited to see the people that are still in my team next year grow even more, and I'm really sad to say goodbye to the people that are graduating or leaving, and it makes me sad. I'm gonna cry later. Uh, not now, uh, but later. So, I guess, let's drive home now! So the tournament's over, so we're leaving Montreal. The celebration of uh, the University Improv team uh, receiving the University Improv Cup next year. Uh, we just bought the sexy surprise. <laughs> anyway, anybody want, want it? <laughs> oh, this is kind of heavy, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually it's actually a pencil sharpener. Why do we have so many auxiliary cord vibrators? Uh, massage lubricant, high quality. Excellent. <laughs> if you want to hear, go ahead. One condom. <laughs> It was fun. It was kind of tiring, a long drive, but uh, it was fun to see all the other teams. I would like to like Insert that song right here. So we've been driving for about eight hours now, and we've cycled through all of the phases. Hurry up! Slow down. Kiloki, balance. Do you want to do anything? I hope we'll fast with you. Kiloki, pass. Come on, it's fun. Boring. Kiloki. Please leave the room as you enter the room. We're excited to get home. 
As if we didn't have enough improv this weekend, tonight was the grand finale of the Improv University League de Licume. I went to the gym this morning. I go to the gym pretty regularly. But this morning, a few friends and I went to a class and nothing gives me anxiety like going to a class that's sort of routine-ish and has movements I cannot follow, not even a little. I have a little bit of trauma from when I was a child and I used to take dance lessons and I was awful at it. And so it always stresses me out. I wasn't too bad, it did, I, I sucked. No, I sucked. Um, but I mean, maybe I'll get better. Maybe I'll just go to the regular gym. I'm to be seen. The dress I'm wearing today either looks like I'm off to win a tennis championship or I'm a crew member in Star Trek. I'm fine with both. Today we're doing our Legionnaires Hot or Not feature for the Legion of Super Bloggers blog. It's basically just a few women with no real knowledge of the superheroes were shown and we're basically asked to just judge them on their appearance and on their personality and just decide if we like them or not. It's pretty fun. Here's a peek at what hero we're judging today. So it's Easter and we're having a pot look. So I'm calling it our pock look. This is a cake with a cross on it and dinosaur sprinkles. Jose is very themed. I'm actually currently editing the video you're watching. I actually really like editing. Vlogs are sort of strange to edit because you don't have a script or a guideline or something. So you kind of just have to look at the footage as is and then sort of find the story in what you have. It's kind of a cool challenge. So meta. In a stunning turn of events, I'm at an improv match. <laughs> Which chocolate will I eat? I think I'm gonna go with this one. My roommates and I have a little problem when it comes to the fridge. We often buy the same products, and so when it comes to actually eating or drinking it, we never know whose is who. So I think maybe uh, we found a solution. My roommates are gone for a few days, so I'm babysitting this guy. <laughs> that spinny thing is my favorite thing! Pow! Of all of Bubby's toys, this is definitely my favorite. Oh! <laughs> Clearly it's his favorite as well. Inside are these amazing dumpling <laughs> things. They're adorable. Okay. So that was March. What have you guys been up to lately? Let me know down in the comments. It's always fun to hear your stories. Thanks for watching.